What up, YouTube? This is your boy Samir Mayfield. This is my seventh day of consecutive vlogging. The things are just way different than I thought they were going to be. It's been great, honestly. Like, I'm having a lot of fun with the vlogging, but today, I went and exchanged my Canon Rebel T6i uh, DSLR camera for a much more compact and a little bit cheaper, better on the pocket, uh, Sony uh, digital camera with interchangeable lenses. So yeah, today was just kind of one of those days where you walk up to the doors at work and you start hyperventilating. Don't get me wrong, I absolutely love what I do and I love my job, especially this part of it. But. Uh, but that's when you just know that there's something you need to change. Before you enter the building to the doors of work, you're just <sighs> Big breath in, big breath out. And it's not even like what I do is super hard work, you know, all I do is really talk to people. It's not like people are that bad. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, people aren't that bad. All in all, pretty much all a job wants is just for you to show up. So if you could show up, you pretty much have 70% of the job done as to why you just show up to class and you pretty much get a C just to pass just for showing up for the most part. So yeah, showing up really is, is the hardest part. And once you show up, once you're there, I mean, the hardest part of the day is pretty much done except for all the work that you have to do. But other than that, show up, say your line. Just like a vlog. So showing up, if you're just gonna be there just to show up, obviously you're gonna be the type of person who just wants to say their line and then leave. The second kind of person is the person who shows up and actually does a good job at work. And those are the type of people who plan on staying with the company for the rest of their lives. If you guys are in a tough situation and you're at work and you're staring at the clock, my best advice to you is to not stare at the clock. Now the third type of person um, is the person who basically doesn't show up to work. <laughs> You're pretty much not gonna have a job for very long. So the big question is, do I show up to work and give minimal effort and just receive a paycheck every two weeks? I mean, that'd be really hard to just like show up and black out for eight hours, but I mean, I've been doing that for years. I mean, really a lot of this is gonna depend on what type of job you have. I mean, if you're working at Wendy's, you've been there for a couple months now, you got the job the first day you walked in for your interview, it's probably not that big of a deal, but if you're working like, a, let's say a call center job like myself, you work at a call center, maybe a little bit higher paying job and around the, you know, 20s. It really depends what makes you happy. What are you looking for in life? Are you looking for millions of dollars? Are you looking for just to get by or just to have a good time or just to and relax and smell the roses, I guess, while you're still alive? I always suggest anyone to just always do a kick-ass job no matter what it is you're doing. Minimum effort will be minimum results. But again, this video is different for everyone. You know, if you're a doctor and you went to medical school uh, to become a doctor, I mean, obviously, if you are going to medical school to become a doctor and you became a doctor and you went through all the certification to do something like that to make the big bubbling, then you probably should just show up to work. So not every day is going to be a perfect day, not every day is going to be a smiley day, and not every day is going to be a sad day. So keep that in mind, things are always changing. And uh, I love you guys, YouTube, for just sticking with me with my videos for this 14 day meaningless vlog. Maybe if I don't call it meaningless, you guys will call it meaningless. You cannot produce something that is top triple A quality, like A plus 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 triple A grade. You know, the triple A grade, A plus plus triple grade chronic, you know? You just don't make things like that on the daily. So that is the truth behind it. But I figure that spending over $1,000 on a camera is not within my budget for my 30 viewers. But what is in my budget is this new Sony camera. Uh, if you guys you know, do like my videos and if you think the quality of this video is amazing, please give it a thumbs up because uh, the video really isn't too much different like from what I can tell at least on the tiny like little screen. Uh, that I can view myself because it has like this little flip out screen. Not everyone has that kind of game. Obviously, I got a selfie game. Anyway guys, please let me know what you think of my videos in the comment section below. Please like, subscribe, give me a thumbs up, stay smiling. You guys rock. Peace!